Well, hello no girls and the French girls. It's Donald. Welcome back to my kitchen. I'm getting much better from the flu now, so it's time to get back in business. And uh, ironically, the matches is when I'm starting to get down from the flu, so... But, let me get to today's menu. Today, I have a budget deck for you. And what I mean by budget is there's only one GX Pokemon in this deck. One. And it is this here, Zorak GX. Because, you know, I kind of want a GX attack. He's really good, and but he's the only GX here. If you don't have it, you can just get this in the theme deck shop. Yeah, he's in the theme deck shop. As well as this card, and a lot of the Pokemons here. But other than that, no other GX Pokemons. All these just regular nice trainers. So I think, uh, you know what? Yeah, you don't need Coconut Master. You can make a deck that runs without it. I'm gonna show you how, too. So, first of all, today's deck is gonna focus on Hoopa GX. Which GX Pokemon can't attack, and that's gonna be very annoying. Because all the meta Pokemons are GX. So if you're loading this Pokemon up, your opponent's like, Oh shoot! I'm gonna have to find a way to f get through this. So they're gonna have to charge up a weaker Pokemon that's not a GX, so they can deal with this. And of course you're gonna abuse the situation because you've got other strong Pokemons behind to help you out too. Very, very strong. I mean, this is one of the best lines in the game right now, Zoroark. So with these two together, this is going to be a seriously powerful budget deck. So, let us get to, uh, you know, I'm going to explain a little, a little bit more in details after this. And you're going to see it in four matches where Donald's coming down with the flu. Yeah. Okay, so, uh, let, uh, let's really get started. Today's intro is saved tonight by EOI Cherry. And, uh, okay. That's, uh, yeah, let's talk about you. All right, break it down. Hoopa, dark side. Hoopa? Okay. He's a mute to GX Pokemon. I mean, he's... He knows his little magic tricks. He's a genie after all. So Scoundrel Guard, ability that always works. No attacks from GX Pokemon or any of those special effects they do will affect us. And that is very annoying to get through. Basically, the only way you can get through it now is not use the GX Pokemons. Which, hey, you know, non-GX are just not as strong as GX. So they'll have to charge something else. I kind of said that. Now he has 120 hit points. Kind of low. Uh, for against the non-GX Pokemons, that's actually not too bad. And Super Side Bolt's 80 damage is very easy to charge up. One DCE, one Dark Energy. That's two Energy cards. Yeah, one Dark Energy. He's good to go on turn two. No problem. 80 damage, give him a choice ban. He does 110, and that's going to two-shot all most GX Pokemon you come with. Two it KOs, they can't hurt you. They'll have to do something about that. And with... Fighting Fury Belt, you can make him, uh, 40 more hit points, 160 hit points, GX level, and 90 hit points. Which he'll be able to take on basic GX's, Coconut Master, but we don't have him here, so... Alright, so, good stats! But the big part is you can't attack him with GX, and this makes your opponent do funny things. Now, you just can't just win straight through Koopa. Your opponent has something to fight that, so we're gonna use a very cheap and easy powerful uh, Zorark line, which we have Baby Zorark. The more bench Pokemon they have, the more damage it does. 30 for every bench Pokemon, plus 10 base. So it goes up to 160 with a full bench, yeah. And he can jump in any time, don't worry about retreat. Give him a float stone and he'll be free retreat for your old team. So you have a lot of backup damage very easily just for DCE here. And what else? Of course, we're going to use Zorark Break, which is not in the theme of the shop, so... If I check the prices on eBay and, you know, I'll click online, the trade value is not that high. We're using two Zorark breaks, but man, it's good! One Darkness Energy, you can use any of your opponent's attacks. And if they have a real good one, you're gonna see, um... Some Darkception going on in here in a bit. So, any Pokemon attacks, no matter how strong it is, and it goes. Plus, he has a pretty good hit points. 140, he is one of the best... Pokemons and the first break Pokemon of all time. So, uh, what else? We have the we have the GX one. I mean, this gets used in lots of videos because it's really really good. Do we have to sell what Berry Master does? Good hit points, good scaling damage, more bench Pokemon. You got up to 120, and you get to throw away one of your cards, your your useless cards, to get two more cards. Yeah, and you can copy any of your opponent's attacks anywhere they are. This guy can only copy from the front. 
This guy can copy anywhere and anywhere it is and use it as its attack. So that is the whole team. You have a strong backup core line here, and you're gonna use Hoopa to mess them up. And they're very, very energy efficient. I mean, DCE, two energies is two energies cards is the most expensive you need for any Pokemon here. And that's just what's so great about the Zorark line. So there's no Coconut Master here. How does that work? Though some of you, you know, are like, oh, no Coconut Master. You just have to have it, and you just don't know the reason why. Coconut Master is a um, Burst Oral Guard. Like, it's a Joker card that can get you any supporter. It turns your Ultra Ball pretty much into a supporter. It's very useful, and you should probably have at least one in this deck. But if you don't, we're going to use lots of deck thinners. Check a look. We have three Nest Balls, two Evil Sodas, in addition to four Ultra Balls. We can just throw our hand out. Pretty much dump our hands with items or play a bunch of items and quickly set up the line now with a small hand you can use banana master to refill it up you can abuse this because you can actually get less than three cards a couple times draw a little bit more draw a little bit more even draw even more with Zorark so you're gonna see a very fast setup you know, by tricking our hand what else all right I've got a lot of cool deck vendors the regular amount of supporters, but basically the spots that were taking Coconut Masters have been replaced with these things. And it works out, thanks due to Banana Master right here. So that's our little trick to get around that. It works well enough. So this is it. This is our budget Hoopa and Zorark deck. So let us get started with the matches. I've got a lot of very nice matches for you, which means I haven't rendered this video and this is going to take a while. So that's a little too much outside. Enjoy the matches. Here we go. Welcome to another Anti-Meta Hoopa Zorak match. I'm gonna play my remix of Kuchisuki Diamond from not other tales. This is from Yamadon Seven Witches, which is over. I'm, I'm sad. Okay, that is all I can do. I could play Guzma, but I don't really. Just to get an extra card pool. Or I can just wait and get Zorak and get an extra card pool. That sounds better. So. <laughs> we put energy, then we can take that out. That's good. You know, Zorak's popular because it's just a good deck. It's one of the best decks. I knew it was. Well, I'm not gonna. I'm bragging. Hi, fighting decks. Do you have enough to deal with this? It's like, yeah, I'll bench snipe your baby Pokemon's out. Guzma. And starts fighting right away. Okay, we can deal with that. You want to kill my Banana Masters? That actually the heavy. Oh, it actually had enough 120k health, and it hits this guy. All right, we'll send this. You can't hit this guy. Okay, what else we got, man? Oh, a draw supporter. Good. All right, you need to guys need to evolve quickly. Got an energy to fight with. Yes. Got an evil Soto. Yes. Oh, that was an excellent, excellent. Look at all these deck thinners. I will fill up my bench. I need another Hoopa in case you do have a way to get around that. Or the Banana Master. You don't seem like you got a way to get around that, so I'll go ahead and get this Banana Master. I love you, Banana Master. See? I love you, man. You're here. I can instruct and trade. Okay, I need everything here. Except maybe this. We're gonna trade it. We're gonna trade it. We got three extra cards due to our basic abilities. All right, that is it. We're gonna use Super Cybolt. Whatever he tries to bench hit, I will play my Zoroark to evolve. And if we can do this, hey, look at this. We took a Buzzwall and and, and, and and Lycanroc. So he has a lot of, you know, pulls with this, so that's not gonna be nice. This is two prize cards. It's a little bit risky here, but I felt like I still needed it, so, okay. 110. If we pull the choice man, we got three choice mans. We can just knock this out of the bat. And it'll be wounded. So, Lycan Rock, yeah, you're gonna be the next guy who charges up. But how are you gonna get through my Hoopas? We'll find out in a bit. Lycan Rock, it's like I can't deal with this. I better pull out your big Zorark GX. Probably GX. Yeah, this is a Zorark GX. Yep. You pulled it out, you're gonna punch me, and it's gonna hurt. Of course it is. Well, I can jump in. I just can't retreat. I don't got the flow zones just yet. They're all in the back of my deck. So, a little too, well, 
I wouldn't say it's a little too early, but let's see. Jet punch, weakness damage. Oh, man. If he does 90 damage somehow, does he actually have 90, 50, 50, 60, 60 right now? So it's still going to hurt pretty bad. Yeah, this is the only biggest risk. Okay, so choice man. I need a lot of stuff. I need... Go for the baby one. So the baby one, yeah, we evolved that so you don't get another prize card with that. Okay, so we'll do this right here. You get the energy next. You you might be able I might be able to GX them too. Choice ban, but we don't have another retreat. But we do have the GX. I can GX. This is gonna be a bit risky. Okay, I can I got the super rod. But I can already evolve that. I need everything here. I need everything. I got the break. I don't have any way to retreat this except jumping in, but I don't have a re can't retreat back out. All right, so we can do this. We can copy one of your moves. We can copy Nubble come back and knock you out. I don't have to risk anything here. That's good. Jump in! Yeah! Save your Absorb Arc, friend. Copy the Knuckle Impact or Absorption. I'll save your GX later. I us evolve this too. Put Choice Man on here. Play, play this. Oh, yeah. I'll take that. Didn't need to. Probably should have saved it, but I still want more card pulls. I'm greedy, man. Look at this. Extra cards. I'll probably need that next turn. Hey, DCE. I don't want to trade anything here, man. Uh, Okay, I can trade energy. Pull something I, um, I might need. I might need something of all the Pokemon. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, no, man. Definitely want that. So I can choose whatever I want. Yeah, everything's lining up. Foul play. Let me do your knuckle impact. Take that, Zorark break. I'll deal with my fighting weakness. Okay, I need another Zorark break. Give me that. I, get, I don't have another energy, so I'll probably give me that too. You're good. We're good, guys. That's right, Dr. Dong. You, got, you, whatever, you know exactly and the best things to do. All right, so that's that. Like and Rock's like, oh yeah, we can deal with this. Well, you got, I got this to, to mess you up. So Hark's scaring, but I have the hoop of the bed block my uh, my uh, stuff. Okay, tool removal. We have plenty of poker tools. How many have we used so far? One. Our, our, uh, our, our poker tools are still in the back of our deck, though. The only problem I have so see so far is still the Guzma's problem, because if I need to get something in the back, I still don't have access to it as easy. So, choice ban. You probably, he has to GX this. I mean, if he wants to keep momentum, he has to GX this. Stroke GX. Okay, well, I, you can't hurt me after this. You got nobody to hype me. Now you gotta hunt and Guzmas and stuff. So far, cards. Well, I'm gonna I'm gonna press the advantage. Now I can copy one of his moves too, but uh, I'm kind of scared. I'm gonna make sure I have this up. Let's see if we can get a DCE up. Nope. So you know what? Let's not charge this. These can go anytime. They're ready to go. I can pull an extra card. Yeah, let's go do that. No, I can just stick aboard. That's probably better for me right now. Find those Guzmas, man. There they are. All right, get a Tusha on you. Uh, nothing can evolve yet. I need, until I get that Super Rod out. Floatstone, yay! Not sure. I'm gonna put on you for the free retreat for everybody. Uh, that's not ready. I need a Super Rod that Zorak break up. So Super Cybolt, two shot on you. He does not have any counter against this right now. So the, this variant. Yeah, you need to have something in to fix that. We still have our GX, but he does not have any bench space. <coughs> Excuse me. Hi, Arteo. G Dr. Don says GXing the baby, rest in peace. Yeah, he got plenty of prize cards. I feel like I can take this out too, but uh, yep. I'm gonna charge up this. This is like the only way I can win is just bench snipe right now. I still can copy your moves and one-shot you. If I had the choice man right here. Yeah, just copy knuckle impact. I can't copy absorption, can I? No. So, you can't hurt me. You can only bench, bench attack me. I need a choice man before I can secure this one-shot. But I'd rather get the prize guards here. Sycamore. We are, we're looking pretty happy. 
shouldn't be in there. But, you know, if you don't have the bus walls, this can do fine, too. That's it? He's not gonna retreat. He's gonna expose that. Okay. I need a choice band. There's no way for me to pull that. So I'm gonna start junking some cards. I'm gonna just try to get the choice band. If I can, I will one-shot this. They're not here. Okay, get the Hoopa charged up. These are ready to go anytime. Yeah, you just need the choice man. That's it. This is two prize cards. I will take it. I will take this. And we can recycle some stuff here. Good. Get that. Get another float stone. Right now, all he has is bench damage. He's got not prepared for the Hoopa at all. If he had the Born of the Zora off break, I would have Guzma. Yeah, that's why I needed the choice band. Uh... I would have, I would have goosed by this and one shot that. Yeah. Nobody can handle the hoopa. Nobody can handle the hoopa. Three energies. I have so much power. So he probably will go. Oh, Guzma. He <laughs> was scared of that. Okay. I would be scared of that too. This is more prize cards, but listen, we know if I finish well. Okay, I'll take that. I'm gonna be very aggressive for that choice win. I know the end of the game is gonna end soon. In fact, if I pull that choice win, I win. I win the game. So, that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna play Sycamore Dex. Choose your Pokemon to be your active. You got a free retreat, so I think it's safe to be with you. Actually, nobody... I don't have the choice band up. I have to take away my own choice band, so we have to send this right here. Let's go ahead and play this right now. I need both, both of you guys, Zach. Uh, I need you. I don't think I can set up another Zorark. I have plenty of energy, so we'll go ahead and do this. Let's start junking some cards. I want one of these two. Let me go ahead and evolve by Zorark. Do I have a two removal? I do have a two removal and a choice ban. Oh! Oh, okay. Okay, in that case, in that case, we are going to be super, very greedy and try to end the game right now. Okay, well, uh, you need bench space for anything? Yeah, yeah, I do. I need a regular energy to win. Okay, so, if I pull all the right cards, I win. Oh, I pulled all the right cards! Good, 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 good. That's it, that's game. Alright, I'll go ahead and take those out there. Hey, man, here's the energy, here's the choice, man. You're going to go ahead and jump in. And we're gonna copy that move of yours and win the game. Foul play. Give me a knuckle impact. Got that! Two prize cards! I was like, ah! Oh, did I have another two removal? Didn't see that. Sweet! Fighting weakness! Yup, the Hoopa blocks the way and makes messes everything up. Make sure you knuckle impact. Thank you, Dr. Don. Got it. Alright, this is this is getting more, more where I want it to be. A budget deck that can do this. Yeah. Okay, moving on, moving on. Do another anti metas or our Koopa deck. I'm gonna play my remix of Closer by the Chain Smokers. All right, what do we got, man? This is charging up. Now, there's no. I absolutely. He does not know I have a Hoopa. Lily, woo! That was a lot of cards just bursting off. All right. Dun, 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 dun. Destroy! Oh yeah, you're gonna need this. Please do take those out. He does not know yet what is, what's coming after him. So there's no way Banana Master can survive, but he can pull like whatever he wants. So I am at the uh, I'm at the, I'm at risk. I'm at a major risk here. Yeah. So anything I decide to charge up is dead. That kind of stinks. So go ahead and play everything I can so I can get some extra pulls. I'll charge you up, Banana Master. You're the only one that can have this, and that's it. I did not get a draw support on this first pull or Ultra Ball. So I'll have to leave it there. If this evolves with the energy and he can retreat, we are in trouble. It is Sushi Master. Sushi Master, hey, Donald. Why well, haven't you been playing me? I'll get, I'll get around to you. I got Banana Master up right now. I'll be, I got, so he, he's my baby. Okay. So what you call? He's my baby right now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Floatstone on this card, but not this card. Well, I'm pretty tanky right now. 
end? Oh, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. It's like, I don't have a choice. I'm gonna end anyways. The whole deck is weak to this. But you don't have anything against this right now. Oh, if I could Guzmas. I need a lot of Guzmas, but more than I thought. I need like three Pokemon catchers. Four Pokemon catchers. Gonna evolve! Pull out anything you want. Like I said, the float zone should have been on here. Pull out the one with the energies, unfortunately. Enhanced hammers. Oh, okay. That's unnecessary. Rescue stretchers able to get that Zorark back up too. The one that gets through the Hoopas. So once we have to finish it off with, by pulling a DCE. So we gotta pull DCE and we're good, okay? So right now, you know, he didn't do the front one. Pulling extra stuff. This is tough. Everyone's more prepared than I thought. This is the this is the number one deck right now. They've got everything covered. Luckily, the, I had another turn. All right, now let's show our hand. He's like, uh oh, I need a lot more baby Zoroks. Okay, and uh, the only thing, let's get you up. Let's make sure we got another Zoro up. Let's charge this up right here. We can get another card pull, but I'm a little scared. I can't evolve anything, so let's go ahead and trade this right up. Wow, very nice hand. Very nice. Oh, you can have I can evolve this too. I can evolve the back one, but I have no ways to retreat this back one. And it might just take this out. I'd rather just evolve this one back here. Yeah, I can evolve this, but I have no ways to retreat this. I've already played my energy. I played it in the Hoopa. Because you can't attack me with this, and so you have to uh, play, uh, like, get this guy out, or Guzma, or something. So, you gotta wait. What's your move? You can take this out. Guzma. Guzma, where are you, buddy? You gotta decide to jump in? Sure. I got a full bench. You can. Oh, it's Zorark for Zorark. Choice man. One prize card for one prize card. Sick more. He's like, where are my energies? Ooh, this guy actually has Guzma and, and, and hell yeah, that's crazy. That's gonna be a lot of pulls. Crushing hammer, getting the energy away. Oh, how can you squeeze all this extra sting in? It's like I can. Don't worry about it. It's, I can do it. Okay. Hey Donald, my name is Kevin. Are you running any Zorak breaks in this deck? Yes, I am, Kevin. All right. So that's gonna be a, not one of these. That's good. We have two Hoopas. You have to get around that stuff. You have to go for my Zoroarks. He got some extra pulls, Banana Master and Octillery at the same time. Holy cow. So, this is up front. He's like, where are my energies? Everything is flowing so well for this guy. I kind of wish I had... Nope, DC! Okay! I just need my DC of my own and we are good. We're cooking, or just regular energy, actually. He's the break here. But he's got that up already, so... We'll see, we'll see. Field blower, take away the... <laughs> okay, you can take the belt out. I'm okay with that. You wanna really wanna save those against me, but uh, let's... I need... Well, just wait, hang on. I'm gonna need DC so I can one-shot this. Or, I got the break here, too, so... A lot, of, a lot of options. How much recycling do you have? It's just a BS to the patrician. I don't have... I'm not trying to play any GX cards here. I don't want to give him a free kill. Oh! He's got... He used up a Guzma. He's probably going to pull this here. He probably is going to pull this. I think. No! He's going to bring the Hoopa out. Oh, and deal with it right away. Smart move. Yeah, because you know that's going to give you some trouble. Okay. Okay, so we got to we gotta pull this out with a special charge. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and start playing stuff out of my hand right now. Get the break up too. I only need one Banana Master, don't I? Okay, get lucky. You got to pull that. Okay, we'll have to use this then. We'll have to use this in the break, unfortunately. Is there any way I can thin my hand a little bit more? Yeah, 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 you do. 
Now, it's actually a good plan to play this. I do need those cards back. Get that special charge back if you want to, too. Yeah, get the special charge back. It's funny how you can thin so many things. Alright, this is the least risky way to do it. I wish I had a DC, just try to straight it. But, this is how it goes. Yeah, we don't have any coconut masters. We don't have sushi. Oh, yes! Yes, Sycamore. Do this. Alright, got some two removals. Some two removals. Uh, you're, you're not going to survive. So I'll go ahead and take this away from you. Got Evil Soda for another breakup. Alright, let's go in. Jump in. Uh, foul play. Copy that. I got another Hoopa to let you have you deal with, so we'll see how you deal with that. You gotta recycle them back or something, so this is risky. But, uh, we're good. Can we take out all the cards that can deal with Hoopa? We're home free! <coughs> Donald, is so Solent online only? I think so. I only read my manga online. So, uh, that's that. Alright, so Zora comes out, and but not Lycanroc. Lycanroc has a one-shot on this. But he doesn't want to send it out. I'm, I'm kind of curious why that is. Lycanroc has a one-shot because of weakness. Alright, getting more ways to pull my Pokemons out, unfortunately. This is the key thing that allows him to hit me right now. So, N. Aww. Why didn't you want to go for a one-shot? I'm curious about that. Where are my float stones? Now I have too many nest balls. I guess you can't get away from Ultra Ball. Trade. I guess because he can juggle this is why I did that. Do I have I can copy it I can copy your dangerous rogue GX and finish this. That's gonna be worth it. Yeah. Yeah, alright, it's beating, but I can't copy your dangerous rogue right now. Okay, so uh, what do we do? We have 190 bursts. We have some tour removals. I'm probably gonna play Sycamore. Let's go ahead and do that. Let's go ahead and play this right here too. Got another Hoopa and Hey, I got a float stone now. That's good. Go for this. I can GX. I probably should GX him. I probably should GX him. You didn't need that float stone. Alright, here's what I'm gonna do. I wasted that float stone. I have an extra one. Uh, I can't get any card pulls even though I play these cards. We're gonna play this right here. We're gonna give this to you. We can foul play his GX. Here we go. Copy his trick or strict GX. Now copy his, uh, what is that GX? Dangerous Rogue GX. A little a lot of copying. Thank you for that. You should have taken me out with that uh, Lycan Rock there. That was a misplay there. Yeah, Dr. Dong, you see it. That is worth it for that. I mean, I get, if I GX gets me a full health Pokemon, worth it. Could he? If, he, he wasn't able to ready to evolve, so uh, yeah. All right. That was a misplay. He should have just finished me off with the Lycan Rock. He had the DC here. He just sent it out and uh, that. But he's like, maybe, maybe he's worried about the Hoopas or something. <coughs> but this should be the la end last turn for Zora Arc. Uh, the only thing I felt I wasted with was the, was the Float Stone, because it's uh, weakened up. Alright, so there's a full bench. Zora can come in and uh, deals a lot of damage. We didn't really have to hide behind a Hoopa for anything at all. And, uh, you know, when you need Guzmas, all three of them, they're not here. Victory, he looks like he AFK'd out. Oh, or he, he disconnect, disconnected. Okay, I'll take that and go. Good job, MVP Zoroark. Good job. Moving on, moving on. Another Hoopa Zoroark match. Today's giveaway winner on Twitch is Bummer. Congratulations, Bummer. So, let's get our match started. I'm going to play my remix of This Is Jump Up Superstar from Ma Super Mario Odyssey. There's a new Yoshi one coming out, so I'm super excited for that, too. Alright, so what do we need? We're gonna need some Banana Masters to 
if I can find some way to, you know, get through it. All right, so what do we have so far? Ah, uh, I think you can go up front. All right, there's no way to shrink my hand right now. I accidentally got two of my recycling cards uh, up. So, pretty slow. Let it be. Vulpix. Vulpix can pull two of any card she wants. I kind of like this for consistency. It's pretty nice. And Tapu Finny. Tapu Finny is here. Can do a lot of bench sniping. If he can pay for an energy cost. The DC is going to go for the back one. So, it's going to be like a Hoopa versus uh, Lola Vulpix War. Beacon. Going to bring out. Now, I'll get to see which Ninetales. I'm thinking maybe Ninetales is coming out. In that case, we're going to need. It's whoever gets the first hit. Yeah, yeah. Two baby Ninetales. Okay, we got a Guzma, but we got no damage. Okay. Since I can't do this anyways. I need some card pulls bad. He can play an energy to attack to retreat this. This is a bit of a waste. Kind of wish I had my Pokedex now. Being bricked sucks, but I'm going to be risky, okay? Hang on. Let's stand in first. I'm gonna bank Banana Master pulls me an amazing next card. Pull out the Finny right now. Finny can't hurt me. Alright. Totally amazing top deck, please. Oh, okay, we'll toss that down. Let it be. Fine. Fine. Hold it. Now he hasn't played a draw support as well, so I'm thinking he's stuck as well. Now he's got, uh, yeah. It's gonna be anti-GX versus anti-GX Pokemons. Luckily, this whole deck is practically not GX Pokemons. There's only one GX here, so it's about who can do this. So as long as he's careful and not put his bench space, he's good. And yes! Yes! The brick is over! Maybe you can use one of the deck ideas from your level 40 chats. I can. I made it for that. I'm looking for someone that's really expiring. That's why it's there. Okay, that's that. Uh, oh, hey. Oh, hey. Oh, hey! What, what can I do with this? Discard two water energies. I can't do that. I like this. Oh, yeah. Hey! <laughs> Alright, so he's gonna play that to retreat, but uh, I can't hurt him. But I will uh, after this. <coughs> Excuse me. The energy went on, let's see, he played Aqua Patch, that gets you an energy from your discard to your bench Pokemon, so this back here. Okay. So we got another free turn where nothing happens. Good. So I'm gonna have to fight soon. I'm gonna get my Zorark Breakout now. Probably. Or I can get some extra card pulls with this stuff. Is the break gonna be better or is the extra card pulls gonna be better? Now the GX, this is just for draws only. I'd rather get a DC right now. That's what I want. I'm gonna go for consistency. I'm looking for a DCE, and I'm willing to pay an end for it. If not, we are just gonna be slow. I have four DCs deck. They have not come out yet. Ooh, not bad. Not too bad for this. All right, I think I can know. I can, okay, town map. Are, are DCs, are you here? Well, energy lot was here, but no, all th all the DCs are my deck, so I can. Uh, uh, uh. Tough one. This is a tough one. I'm gonna be greedy for it, okay? I'm gonna be very, very greedy for this. Here we go. Let's go get Zorar Break as you can evolve up. You can copy a Roar Beam. We're also, you know, we just chunked a bunch of energies. We're gonna thin. We're gonna get a ton of extra part pulls for our Pokemon. I'm shuffling those dark energies back. I want that DCE. I'm gonna use this to trade, so that's why it's here. No, trade the Tour Bubble. DCE. <sighs> All right. Okay, I'll, I'll take some damage. Let's go. Come in. Aurora Beam. 80 damage to you. You can do 80 damage back, so I'll lose this Zorark break. Not the good. It's okay. This is a stage one. I'm a stage two practically. It's gonna be uh, a weird one. It's gonna be a weird fight. Or I can retreat and send this guy out. That'd be good. I need some Zorox right now. We gotta check a chatter. Maybe you can, uh, let's see. Have you ever thought about improving one of your the legendary battle decks? I haven't... I haven't checked up on what's actually in those legendary battle decks. At least uh, the standard ones. The expanded last one I can remember is like a Rayquaza. So 
That's a no. So far. Malo! Malo, it's like, I wish you had some Malo. Some at least Pokedex here, but you took them all out. I wish I had some Pokedex too. I'm definitely gonna stick those back in. Those are cool. Those worked out for a bit. Okay, so that is that. He can pull whatever he wants, he's gonna get next. But I think he might be stuck. I mean, he'll get. Yeah, that sucks. That means you lose one of these for free with a DCE. Let's keep going. I may not have any Tapu Lele's, but I can still set up just fine. Uh, this is for recycling those DCEs. He doesn't seem to have much to. Well, I, I'd rather not risk it, okay? Let's just end. Let's just end. I mean, you Mallow, you're not gonna get what you want. <laughs> Excuse me. Uh, this just came down. I can't do it. I can't attack with this. But I can't attack with this. Oh. Alright. That's all we can do. I'm gonna chuck the Hoopa out because I think we both know... <coughs> Excuse me. That, 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 that's not gonna be of any use. Okay, so this is gonna be much more use. These Banana Masters can get one shot. You should have been charging up first. That would have been smart throughout the game. Uh, okay, foul play. Do this. So, there's only one GX of this deck. Hey, energies. I don't need energies right now. I need Ultra Balls. I need Evolve my Pokemon. You know, this is the well, this is the only other one I have. Floatstone's nice. Yeah, Floatstone. Free retreat for all. Then we're going to need this next. I love you, Town Map. I don't know. By the way, have you guys posted anything in that special chat? I'm reading it. I like to read the description style. Quad Banana Masters. Goose Lord. No, no. Oh. Okay, moving on, moving on. I do read it. Okay, Sartail, Sushi Master. Right now, I think I have the much more intimidating line. Yeah. When he's set up, it's it's a brawl between between GX immune Pokemons. You know, this is pretty pretty good. I wonder if I can fix this up, make it better. Well, we're trying to make a second budget that you should try Zekrom and Rashirum with Electros. That was, that looks like a tough one, uh, the dragon. Ooh. Okay. Floatstone. Run away. He's not ready yet. <coughs> Ninetales break is out. Kind of scary. Though we do have Hooper for this. And he's careful not to fill up his bench, so to the point that I can't uh, take it out. So, we're going to play this right here. Zorar. I can recycle this, but there's no veil to, you know, do that. You got a free float stone. I can retreat anywhere I want. Um, I can, can't knock this out yet. He's careful with that. He's very careful. But these have one shots on those future Burnett. So I said that I'm going to do that. Uh, let's stand in. Let's, you know, protect that Zoark there. And we could trade, but we don't have to. We can't get anything at, at all. No, no, no. We're straight. Here we go. Trade. Trade this Ultra Ball up. The card I need is in here, so I can't get anything for that. Alright, Super Cybolt! 80 damage. Donald, if you're playing a cool game later, we'd love to see. I'm re I'm sick right now. I gotta drink water. I I, I do a game I want to play, but I gotta drink water and sleep and... Because otherwise, I'm gonna stay sick for a while. I've gotta get this illness away. The cold... In the dry weather. Yeah. Uh, it's no good. It's no good. Alright. N. He's breaking a lot. I feel bad about that. But things are lining up. He's got the bench snipe now. So, yep. That comes out. You can bypass and start hitting, you know, two shot the Zorark. Then that will happen because I do not have this. This is the only other Zorark break. I would do that. Luckily, I can recycle them. Ice Blade. If I copy of a GX. Now, he did fill up more his bench space a bit. So, we can get some value. You know, before you die, attack. But if I can get, let's see, how much damage would you do? You know, I'd rather not invest in him. You get a two shot in this. I'd rather not waste an energy on you. You're gonna die anyways. Yeah, let's invest in... You or you. I have no, I don't know. I got a Guzma, I can finish that off if I want to, but let's go ahead and do, deal with this. 110, GX immune. You can't hurt this, it's my wall. 
a great wall. By the way, Soul Land looks cool. Oh, thank you, Satoshi. It was a very, very good read. Luckily, there are lots of chapters. You'll lose your soul through that. Oh, there is Glaceon. Oh, that's not good. Okay, wait, we, we do have solutions. We have a solution to everything. It's just about momentum. If you, as long as you can keep up, you're, we're good. All right, energy goes to that. Well, okay, we got, oh yeah, they're ready. It's like, well, I see that. We can deal with that. No problem, Donald. Actually, it's like, right, let me deal with that. I can do deal with that. Tool removal, gets two tools. Take a look. Oh yeah, I got plenty of tools. We can, uh, we can hold out, but this, I can't get a one shot on this. And, okay. I actually get more cards. That's good. Right now, we want to finish this up before it GXs me. If it GXs, it just heals itself. And there's no other GX that's actually strong with this. So, the best move would have been to GX, pull something, then GX out there. But so, let's see. We do not have another choice band right now. See if we can pull it. Ice Blade. Goodbye, Zorark. Tied up. Tied up. So now I'm gonna come out and, you know, I can't let this go. This doesn't do enough damage right now. This does. Uh, Ultra Ball. What's junk? What is junk? I think this is junk. Angie, both of these are not junk. Uh, this is tough. Uh, this is a means to an end. We'll get another baby one out. That does not look like I'm seeing any more bench sniping. Yeah, there is. So we'll have to hurry. Let's go ahead and pull some more cards out. Ooh, 14. How would he have so much card tools without any coconut master? Oh, hey, choice man! Well, in that case, we don't have to send our Zor arc up. We can just send this guy. Unless the Fighting Theory belt is... Yeah, take the belt. Save the choice man with somebody else. Actually, that does not do enough now. You need 90. But I would have preferred the belt anyway. So go ahead and jump in. What can we do? We're gonna go ahead and foul play. We're gonna copy Blizzard Edge. Discard two energies. I lose one energy though. Foul play. And now I get the, what do I need? This is the only other one I have. I'll take an Ultra Ball too. Oh man. Be careful with your card pulls. <coughs> You're watching your Neo. Oh, thank you, Satoshi. I'm glad you like. I'm glad you like Neo. Neo is a great game. Moving on here. Glaceon. Glaceon's up. I can't hurt it with my sword arc, but we've got we got these guys ready. We can deal with anything with this. Woo! Okay, waiting. Discarding. He discard Professor Kukui. Twenty bonus damage could is you know very useful if if you get it at the right time. So, Zoark, so uh, the, the GX version comes out. There's only one Hoopa, but it causes so much problems. So, I do not have another stand in retreat race, so this might be the best way to retreat. So, let's see. Hoopa's out here. Alright, this is the best way to retreat. I'm gonna attack the Pokemon that can't hurt me, that's almost, you know, gone. We're gonna put this on right here. We could trade, but we're very, very close uh, to victory. Let's go ahead and trade, though. These are just means to an end. I'm gonna get my Zorark up, because I know the break is in, breaks in my hand. I'm gonna get this into the safe zone. Put that up right there. I could, could get some card draws. You know, this is a free card draw. You got 12, you can talk, you, you're okay pulling. So let's do that. We can afford to pull some more cards. Double Banana Master draws. Floatstone, now we got free retreats. Okay, that's good. In that case, you can you can have this. And we get another card pulls. 11 cards! That's okay, keep pulling. And I can still pull this. I don't know if I have another end or not. Better not risk it that badly, Donald. But you could have traded the Hoopa, because there's no reason to have another Hoopa right now. Oh, hey, energies. I'll take that. Two prize cards, 10 cards. We'll be okay. We got one Guzma left. We got some recycling. Let me see if there's both super rods. I think I played both. One. Okay, there's another super rod. We're okay. And luckily there's no energy discards. Otherwise, uh, we're good. I need to invest in some Zorak GX. This user decided. Well, I only got one. This, uh, this is supposed to be budget. You know, something entry level that can, uh, that's, you know, pretty hot. You know, pretty good. So, so far. Yeah, there's only one GX card here. The 
deck engine is meant to work without the Zorark, so here we go. Zorark break. Hello, Mr. Break. Nobody, uh, free, free retreat float stones? Yep. We're gonna send you out right now. You can have an energy to attack. I could pull another energy, but I can't play another energy this turn. I can pull, get more cards, but I'm running low. I better wait this out, guys. 90 damage, that is two shot potential. Even if we did 80 damage. Yeah, that only these guys can attack it. I got Banana Master that can deal with this too. <coughs> this is looking like it. I have one more Guzmas. I can be aggressive to try to pull that out. But the Hoopa is pretty big. The Hoopa is dead. Alright, well played. I will say well played back. That is game. We are going to finish it right away. Hi, Kuzma. Late to the party. There we go. So. I want to I wanna brush up that deck. That thing is, looks pretty caught. Okay, so that is it for now. That's, yeah. Congratulations. Uh, Good game. Good game, uh, Balmer. And moving on. Moving on. Welcome to another anti meta Hoopa match. I'm gonna play my remix of Astra Squares from Undertales. Yep, we're done. Hoopa sup? I mean, you're fighting with a GX, you're in problem. You gotta go for plan B. Whatever your plan B is. Mewtwo! Yeah, Mewtwo can fight with Hoopa? What is this? A full fix with a Mewtwo and. Oh, I had such a nice hand. <coughs> <laughs> Looks like we have a bunch of energy types. Oh man, he's got water. And let's see, he's charging up the Vulpix, so he's gonna fight with that. Now I don't care what Vulpix it evolves to. He goes to the GX one. Fine, we can deal with that. If he goes, the problem is he gets to attack right away. That's the only thing I don't like. I don't have any draws supporters this time around. But I'll be able to get a Zora arc up. So if he fills up his bench a little bit more, we're kind of good. Right now we have time because of Hoopa's out. Alright, ending it right there. Well, what else you got? Like, this... They're trying to look at my hand? Suspicious. Why don't you play closer anymore? I'll do that. We can do that next. Alright, so we're going to get Zora arc. And unfortunately, I have nothing else I can play. Alright, I'm gonna end it right there. There's not much for me to do Let's see. He does only has one bench Pokemon. So we need a little, little bit. Oh, you filled up your oh well well now Okay, so we're good. I have Guzma right here He's got Zorark nine tails GX or just nine tails or both so Two energies up there can't evolve it. I will take the. I will take that card then. Okay, so we are unfortunately a little bricked with our hand right now. So let's pull this out right here. Your only Pokemon that can attack. I can't evil soda this turn, but I will next turn. So my Jack. There we go. Should not have another attack already. Sweet. Zorark. I have plenty of nest balls. Those baby ones are gonna come out later, right? Probably so soon. All right, so Zora, baby Zora, gonna come out, and it looks like the GX one is here. Well, okay, back off, guys. Time to back off. We're gonna send this out. Aqua Patch is coming back up. So actually, I can keep on fighting with this. It's okay, but I can evolve it again, and it's gonna be pretty. Yeah, then I can copy any move you want. Ah, you want? I think I want. All right, so leaving it here. <coughs> excuse me, excuse me, field blower. Good, now we get a float zone. We're gonna definitely get stick it on here. Alright, so Coconut Master, we are not running any single Coconut Masters in this deck. And now I'll kind of feel it because you don't have the Ultra Ball access to that. Alright, what do you bull? N? <laughs> Lucky if it's N. Uh, probably Sycamore. I need some water. I gotta stop coughing. Hang on. We can't just pay for the retreat. It's gonna be baby, uh, Big Zorark. 
Oh, so many GXs. So let's see, this is the only thing he seems to be able to fight with right now. Well, this these that can get through the Hoopa. And he gets a DCE too? And he's able to finish this off? That's not good. Oh, you need one more turn. So right now, we just have to make sure we can deal with the Hoopa. I'm sorry, the Mewtwo. Or these may become baby ones. And then we'll be in trouble. That's lame. That's lame. Okay. Baby Zorark, you gotta show up, man. You gotta show up. We got a couple left. There we go. Sweet. So right now, I should be safe unless he's got Guzmas and in total control. Okay. So we also get energy, too. So, hey. Dark energy, I'll take it. But I need, I need the babies out much, much, much sooner. Oh, we don't have a draw, so I think this is gonna get me something. Oh, yeah. Look at that. Beautiful draw. I like that. Let me keep this hand. On top, give me that sycamore next. Then uh, everything doesn't matter. It absolutely does not matter now afterwards. Okay. That is all I need to do. I'm not going to play this because this causes my deck to be shuffled. So I'm going to hold on to that one right there. Right now, none of your Pokemons can get through this. Although this can go for the bench line. And I don't have this charged up. I should be. I should have been charging this up. This should probably should have got the energy instead of this. I was not thinking about that. So he tries to hit this a couple times. It is not so good. Yeah, this should been. This should have got the energy. This should have got the energy. He doesn't have the Samio to right up. But if it did, he should retreat and start sniping the bench line. He's got a full bench. So we can do a ridiculous amount of damage if we choose uh, the correct Zorak. But if we evolve with this one, uh, whatever, man. <laughs> and then, then it's going to take a while for this to get, come out to uh, finish us off. So uh, this probably is going to help me with the most consistency. Yeah. 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 Hi, Dragon. Welcome. So it turns out... Oh, you killed my baby. Well... You gotta do 60 damage. Float stone, just in case. You do bench damage now. Our opponent sets up... We need to drop those basics faster. Three energies! Oh, this is so good. Well, you can't get through this completely. I'm still... I only care about the Mewtwo. That is the only thing so far that I can feel can beat this. So, right now, where it's time to do some recycling. I got plenty of energies left in my deck. Yeah, the energy want the wrong card. Let's go ahead and play this right here. There we go, man. Now all those evil sodas are going to be more useful. Play, uh, get the Zorark. Two Zorark is fine. I already got Banana Master, but you know, he might get the Hoopa. Yeah, get another Hoopa out. End it right there. So, I'll be able to attack soon, and he's gonna have to send this out. Maybe GX? We're gonna wear him down if we can start attacking. If he tries to go for the, you know, bench line method. Or he could try to fight with the Mewtwo. That's deadly. But it's all down to... <laughs> all GXs so far! This is good! Here's a go! Hoopa, you're doing a good job. He only has four prize guards so far. So, you can only Guzma so many times. Getting this one charged up, I think he's got a baby one. So, we want to take this out. Guzma again, taking one of my, killing my poor babies. Now he has the 50 damage. Yep. Poor babies. Poor babies. We have time. We can wait. Now, as long as I don't fill my, my bench too much, I can uh, actually take that out too. So I need another DC, if I, then I would definitely would have take this out. I would take these two guys out, actually. Okay, I want a DC. I want a DC. I want to start fighting this. Don't get it. Nope. Let's go ahead and take away your cards right here. It's not flowing consistently. I'll go ahead and evolve this right here. We can get a break pretty soon. I'll go ahead and drop this too, so we can get some extra pulls. There we go, two extra pulls. Wow, I didn't think I could melt that. Okay, DCE, shoot. That's that's too late. 
Ended right there. All right, did we discard the Guzmas? Oh, poor Guzma. I think we need to just need Pokemon catchers here. We try to try that next. How many Guzmas have you used up so far? Three. Well, good luck. He don't count Guzma anymore. So as long as I can finish off your babies, your the guys that can attack, such as Mewtwo, we actually have resistance against this, so that's gonna be good. Yeah. And sure, you ran out of Guzmas. You got nothing else, and your end's only gonna get you three cards. All right, so maybe we can start taking good back, taking back control of the game. That's good. Okay, this is a good time to play Superod and N as well. So our break, baby, uh, uh, baby, you. I just need another energy card. I, I'm gonna go for a dark energy because it's a little too much. Now, you're out of gas. I don't have any GX Pokemon. Charging this up, you should be charging this guy up. I didn't think about that. Well, this doesn't do it does as much damage. Or maybe this guy. He's like, I can't get my baby Zorark out. That would do a lot. So let's see. I don't want him to do 100 damage. I should not throw another bench Pokemon down. Trade, go for it. Now if he exposes that, that's fine. We'll hit him with back with this. So this is why I may not throw this out. Field blowers. Oh, that should be his last field blower. But that's all my choice bands. That is all my choice bands. But I still have the fighting fury belt. I still have the fighting fury belt. All right, Trey, gonna do some bench snipe in. Let's see. Can we do a lot? I mean, actually, we did a choice man. We could almost one shot this. All right. What do we do? We evolve. We can start attacking. He has a full bench, but he's gonna GX me, so I can't really work with this. All right, so I think this is actually a good time to play this right now. Recycle this, make sure the GX is available for pulling. I know you can't goose it out. I'm scared that he has, uh, you know, it's okay. That he'll one-shot the Hoopa if I play that down. I'm gonna play safe, put this right here. I need to set up. I'm, I'll be. I'll risk it. I will risk it. Please don't involve the Zorark. Okay, another energy. That can't use that right now. All right, we do get the Fighting Fury Bell. That's good. And Zorark will be able to attack, do something later. So, Cybolt with too many energies. Mewtwo is looking so happy. And right now, I can finish this off with the uh, with this guy right here. So I'm looking forward to that. How oh, it's worth the trade. So so far, we just gotta get Mewtwo and the hoop is safe. And this, this is more important. I need Pokemon catchers. I don't think I can take uh, take the Guzmas in a sec. All right, little B. He can't. He can only go for 50 damage again. He's like, maybe I should hit the baby. All right, that's fine. Gonna wait. What you got? Is it? I have three prize cards. I can definitely win. I have five. I've only taken one. I think I can still win. But this is challenging. But luckily this Hoopa is doing its job. It's blocking my opponent from doing his uh, doing his job. So if I attack again, he'll probably run away. GX, I'm definitely going to come and copy his uh, Blizzard Edge right here. And uh, that will expose this. He'll get another prize card closer to winning, but he will, he'll have to fight. He'll have to fight with this. Oh, man. He got the counter card, bro. He's got the counter card. That's not good, but he flips this all away. Okay. And he sends this one out instead. Instead of this guy, because he can still jump in. Or he wants to snipe this off. He can do it in one more turn, I won't have it then he'll have his GX available. Oh, this is tough. Or I could GX him. Then he'll uh, that that'd be that'd be good. No he had a counter. We want to Guzma this. No, he had an Acerola. All right, Ultra Ball. You can't get any other Pokemons. I think it's this game. Maybe. Maybe, it could be. Could be. Another Alola Ninetales. Why not? We have the ability to finish it off next turn, so he'll be able to hit this card. 
but he can already deal with the Hoopa. I mean, he can already one-shot this. No, he can't. Yeah, I have the Fighting Fury Belt. That's 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 a whole that's a different story. So stand in. Oh, you can't one-shot that. Okay. I have the Fighting Fury Belt. Mind Jack, I'm still alive, and this is gonna make the whole the whole all the difference. Okay. Let's start playing. Stand in. I need an energy. No, I've already played an energy. But I need more draws. So let's go ahead and play. I don't know what choice man's. I'm gonna need to dump my stuff. I need to dump my stuff. You got a DCE right here? Sweet. Okay, we'll take the DCE instead because uh, I kind of want to keep that. Pull an extra card in. Another Banana Master? Yeah, we'll take the bench space. Get me the extra card pools. I'm running low. Now I get to copy your attack. Foul play! Hey! Alright, that's gone! Alright. How many Zoroks can I set up? They're all in the back of my deck. Not good. Gonna send this out, and he may have to pull a very big attack to finish this off. And after that, we're good! We gotta charge up this Hoopa right here. Because that's the guy, who, yeah, you gotta fight Vex. Always gotta mute you to fight against you. And how, let's see, did he have a... He burnt up his tool removals. <laughs> we have a lot of nice tools, so I kind of bait that out. So, so far, I don't think you got any Guzmas. You have to deal with my Hoopas as they come on through. I wish I could heal this, but I can't. Kill the Mewtwo and the Baby Zorark, you might have a chance. Yeah! Guzma, where are you? One more left. Oh, man. Maybe, uh, we get some, uh, try some counter, counter catchers or something so we can get some pulls or regular catchers. Because I'm not hitting the, uh, I'm not, uh, we'll get that shot after. The Mewtwo cannot one-shot me. Oh yeah, it can. He, he just needs a DCE. Does he have any DCEs in this deck? He's got two, so it's possible. We can have to send this guy out. Three energies. He's gonna use Blizzard Edge. Otherwise, I would copy his move. All right, so two prize cards, but you can't you can't use them anymore. You use them all up. Mewtwo with a DCE could finish this off. So uh, I'm gonna be prepared. I'm ready to fight next turn. Hey, another Zor. There's no tour removal needs for me to do that right now. Super Bolt Ray. Super Bolt Ray. Super Cyball. 120. Well, you can start bench sniping. 50 damage. That's gonna take a couple turns, and you gotta retreat this eventually. I still have another Guzmo. Which have been wasted. Wasted, 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 wasted. Okay. Trading. Looking for that DCEs or just regular water energies. He can still go for 50 damage on these guys and get get another prize card. That's yeah, you know, that's kind of risky for me. Or actually, let me see. Is this energy count been hurting? I'm not sure. He got two energies. He's gonna try to get this poor baby Zoroark out. So if it evolves, I'll be able to finish this. So that'd be very nice. Let's see. You can evolve. It's like just <sighs> can't finish it. If only you could have evolved, then we'd be okay. Hang on, be a little, uh, get a, get, get a little risk, a little risky here. Take that. I might be able to pull it. It's there. I might be able to evolve it, but it won't uh, be enough. I don't want that. I don't want that. Oh. All right, pull it. I'm not throwing that down again. He found a way out. All right, that's all we can do. You can take that, or you can retreat. What, well, Uncle Patch? Only works on these guys. Okay, <laughs> one prize card away. Can we hang on? Can we hang on? Trading. This is not crazy. This is crazy. I'm not throwing you out again. I've known. I've learned my mistake. I've learned my mistakes here. Does he ever? Yeah, it's one retreat cost. 
Then I have to goosebump that out. Three energies! Crazy. So now... Choice man, whatever. Don't throw another baby out. N. I get some extra card pulls. Sweet. <sighs> Needed you in that last turn. Ice path. Gonna heal up. It does nothing. Okay. Well, in that case, we can evolve you. But you'll be able to hit me off. I don't like that, but I got no choice. But you don't got ice bat anymore. You're gonna get this one way or another. It's gone. So I'm gonna go ahead and jump in and deal with that right now. Rum decks. I have nothing else I need. Except. Except maybe something. You know, let's go ahead and play the Rum decks. I think the Guzma's out here. I better look at the town map. Uh, on top? Give me a look at the town map when I get a prize card. Or might get a prize card. Alright, this guard is dead no matter what next turn, because he can bench snipe it. We are going to go ahead and stand in. We're scared of decking out, so we're not going to pull extra any extra stuff. Here we go, Mind Jack. 130. He has much damage. You already popped your GX to heal yourself. So, we got to wait this one here. S turns out, I need a lot of ways to pull these out. Trade! Got the Espeon, no matter. One prize card, I'm hanging on. He needs three attacks on the Banana Master to, to finish me, but I can, uh, you know, I can do pretty good damage. Three energies here, sure. He didn't need that. He needs to be charging this up, but he's not. He's forgotten about this. That's good. Ice Blade. Ah, one more prize card to go. All right, we're gonna try to keep you locked. I don't really want to draw four more cards. Town map. Don't tell me Guzma's here. Guzma's stuck up there. The last Guzma's is stuck up there. 90. We just have to straight attack. We just have to straight attack. He's... So three turns. We gotta give him three turns. Yep, gotta run that away. He's like, do I have enough energy to fight this? If he's got a DC, then I've lost. Right there. Got a DC to finish it off. It's like, oh, you should have sent the weak one out. Boo. I couldn't pull through this one. Good game. Good game. Well, looks like you reached the end. So, it's time we write this deck. Let's break it down. Here we go. Hoopa. What is good about... Well, actually, let's talk about this deck. What is gr the big trade about this deck? There are a lot of things here. There's a lot of tricks you could have in this bag. You have the immunity from GX, which you messes with people. You have the ability to copy your opponent's attacks for cheaper than they can attack with their stuff. You have very efficient attacks here. There is a lot of good things that sets it above other decks here. So it's not just one thing. I'm gonna give them five out of five. Your unique trait is you just have a lot of very nice stuff to go with you. So damage, it's gonna be normal. I mean, you don't, can't get a one-shot KO. You maybe can get a one-shot KO. Yeah, but you're very squishy, so you're not going to survive too long. And with these being able to copy your opponent's attacks, with the GX, that's one time they can get a one-shot KO and maybe some more. It's not a guarantee. It's a sometime, so that's just like every other deck. Four out of five, average. Can't rate it any more than that. Set up! You know, with this ability, you don't, you don't have a lot of luxury. Everybody is just one single prize card. GX Pokemon can't attack this. I mean, even if uh, you do have an evolution line, it's stage one is very good and just used in many decks just just as it is. Yeah, it's super fast. However, uh, what the, this is actually pretty key to this deck. Like Zohar Break, you need this foul play to win certain matchups and it is, you know, kind of getting it. Even though everything else is fast, you kind of need this thing, so I'm going to give it a 4 out of 5. It's not all about Zorark Break, but it's still essential, so 4 out of 5, average setup. Everything balances out. Defense, 5 out of 5. Why? This is the only thing that you're straighting up for two prize cards. You only have one of it, and you may not even need this. You may even just go for all six prize cards. 
all six prize cards. That's the key. And you can fight and trade on par with other GX Pokemons. And you have GX immune Pokemons to deal with that. So, all together, good luck stamping all six prize cards of this out. Okay, so, rating. I like it. I like it. I can feel that, the, you know, there are certain matches I'm, uh, you know, have trouble against other matchups. It's good. Overall, I think this is a pretty strong deck. Yeah. For a budget deck, this is something very, very good template to start off with. So, 4.5 out of 5, I put the... Uh, yeah, I have faith in this. You'll be able to, you know, feel like, oh, I'm an equal match footing with others there. So, um, weakness. So, our break is a bit slow. And it's kind of essential. It's going to get pulled out and hunted down. And that's just, you know, part of it. Don't worry, you can deal with that. You got six prize cards you can wait with. And um, upgrades. Minor tweaks. You may want to put a Coconut Master in here. You know, take one of these nest balls out. If you don't have Coconut Master, it's too expensive. That's fine. That's what this deck is kind of for. Uh, it does allow your opponent to, you know, try to drag it out, get two more prize cards. So you may not want that. Or it's like, oh, I really have to have Coconut Master to be competitive. Sure, sure, sure. Let's go ahead and stick them in. It, it does kind of fit. So uh, things like that. Minor tweaks. That's the only thing. I would just maybe tweak up. You feel like you need something, add it in. That's all I can say. Uh, there's not much I want to change with this deck. I really like this one a lot as a budget deck. So, that is it. What is up for next time? I'm going to modify this deck a little bit. I'm going to use the Evil Tall e -G -X -E -X. Right now, there's a lot of fighting. And I think Dark, you know, maybe uh, this one has Hoopa to deal with some of the fighting Pokemons. Maybe we can just use the resistance from this guy. And he's quite compatible with Acerola. So, we're going to uh, squeeze him in and see, you know, how... Oh, it was. So, that is that. That's going to be for tomorrow. Okay. And that, that match, I'll still be sick. Okay. Or going to be sick. Uh, okay, that's it. It's time to wrap this up. Here we go. So, uh, thank you very much, Integrals Differentials. Totally like, subscribe. You know you want to see more Pokemon videos just like this. Follow me on social media. I'll give you clues when new things are happening. Uh, my Discord link is right above my head. Check it out. All right, remixes. If you really like the remixes I do for these songs, they're on iTunes, Spotify, wherever you like to stream your music. Next video is tomorrow, and I have other secret YouTube channels down in the description. That is it for now, in the Bros and the Frenchies. Thank you very much. Take it easy, stay safe. I will see you guys next time. Bye-bye.